Facing lines like this when DMV and BMV offices reopened this year. D579. So how long you have to wait to take your driver's test? Ain't no telling. Many drivers decided to opt for this instead, online renewals. But the Better Business Bureau now says many drivers, like Ted Hicks, are ending up ripped off by look-alike websites. So I go in and just click all the radio buttons and renew. But he was charged over $100 by some out-of-state company. And the BBB says more and more people are ending up on fake state sites when they Google for license plate or registration renewals. So from the doesn't that stink file, what happens if you visit a lookalike motor vehicle site? You may get your plates renewed, but you can be charged another $25 to $100 for them to do it for you. And that stinks. The FTC this year sued the Florida company behind dozens of lookalike websites like online DMV services. But many still have the state's name on their website, so look for the fine print that says it's not affiliated with any government agency. When you visit a motor vehicle website for the first time, make sure it's the state's website so you don't waste your money.